So how does ErgoD2 work? Well, we have two components, ergothionine and vitamin D2. Mm -hmm. It works because they, they have a synergistic relationship in cells. We think that iron is very important in your well-being, your immune system. And we find that ergothionine gives, I don't want to get too scientific, gives an electron back to iron. So plus three iron can't carry oxygen. Plus two iron can carry oxygen. So it's very important to have as much natural iron in your body as you need. Remember, iron is in the red cells. Mm -hmm. Iron carries oxygen. It's, it's your well-being. It's how healthy you are, how much iron you have, and how much oxygen you can carry to your cells. Ergothionine is also in the membrane of the cell where the transporter is that moves ergothionine out. And ergothionine has its own transporter to bring whatever your cells need into their internal environment. Mm. And so internally you have iron, you have ergothionine, and you have vitamin D2. And so if you give an electron, if you remember your chemistry, back to iron, which is plus three, you then lower the plus three down to plus two, and that becomes natural and physiologic. However, iron then needs to be transported back into the bloodstream from inside the cell. Right. So there's a thing called hepcidin that's in the cell, and vitamin D2 neutralizes hepcidin, and then hepcidin cannot interfere with the transport system for iron called ferroportin. Kind of gets complex, yeah. but it works, and then iron moves back out of the cell and can be used by hemoglobin and, and oxygen.